if you can't cut paper with your knife, then the knife's edge needs maintenance or sharpening. Because there are so many variables, the hardness of the knife's steel, the angle of the knife's cutting edge, and the sharpening steel or honing steel's coarseness, understanding the concept of what you're trying to accomplish when using a honing or sharpening steel is important. The cutting edge on most kitchen knives has a double bevel, although some Asian knives have a single bevel. Kitchen knife edges can range from 12 to 25 degrees. If the knife is a higher quality one, you should be able to find out the angle from the manufacturer. This Wusthof is listed at 28 degrees, which means each angle is 14 degrees. The goal is to pass the knife's entire edge along the steel at the correct angle. If the angle is too high or if the angle is too low, the knife's performance won't improve. If the angle of the knife edge is unknown, here are some guidelines for common edge angles. Learn how to use a steel with your cheap knives. Run a marker along both cutting edges. This knife blade is about three quarters of an inch wide. Here's a chart to use stack quarters as an angle guide. I'll classify the knife that I want to hone as a paring knife. So it should be from 12 to 17 degrees. If there isn't an exact match, start with the lower angle. I'll try two quarters first. Honing and sharpening steels are similar to sandpaper. Some steels are more coarse than others. The coarser the steel, the more material you will remove from the knife. A smooth steel is best for maintaining an edge. If the smooth steel isn't honing the edge, you can try using a coarser steel to reset the edge a bit. Ceramic and diamond steels are best for knives made with very hard steel. Don't use a steel on your Asian knife without checking with the manufacturer if it is okay to do so. Position the quarters and the knife on the steel to get an idea of what angle you should use. Hold the steel vertically and place it on something that won't slide. You can hold the quarters in place or just eyeball the angle I'll make a light pressure pass on either side of the blade. Check the edges to see if the marker has worn away. Adjust the angle as needed. When you have the correct angle, you can make a few more passes, applying a little more pressure on each side. Try cutting paper as feedback to know when you are finished honing the knife's edge. To learn how to use a steel effectively, it does take some time and effort. Even the cheapest knife's edges can be aligned. If the knife's edge is worn away, then it can't be realigned with the steel and the edge needs to be sharpened. I hope you found this video helpful. A thumbs up is always appreciated. Click on the channel name, know how now to find other videos, and thanks for watching.